with me today is the professional Weeaboo. Say hi. Why do I still come back here? <laughs> uh, we're playing Outlast 2 again. Uh, this time, hopefully, the professional Weeaboo will stay professional and stay off his phone. <laughs> Maybe contribute something. <laughs> I was contributing how scared I was of oh this game. Oh my god, shut up. I was so terrified, couldn't you tell? I hope we're still in that last place, because I, <laughs> I don't want to have to do all of that again. Here we go again. Another day, another super scary video that we got. <laughs> Some guy with a camera. Literally shaking right now. Can't you tell? Looking for his waifu. <laughs> we just had a, like a half an hour long discussion about how much I hate Sword Art Online. Uh, really? Well, man. I mean, at least you know what to do this time. I guess. My man's just like, wow, you're a sinner, and she's like, come on, man, we crashed, bro, don't give me that shit. Forgot the controls for a second. <laughs> Alright, this time, I'm not going to use all of my battery. fellows seem like pleasant people. I should invite them to my next birthday party. There was... This. Jesus, there's more lens flare than a J.J. Abrams film. No oh, scary thing coming up, remember? Can't get me with the same thing twice. No, sure as hell try. Alright. Caution to the wind, let's go. Hey, a bandage. We were playing this on hard mode because I was like, come on dude. No, don't do this on easy or normal. That's for losers. Why why is he cussing? I'm not on my Christian server. Hi guys, it's me, Carson. You could have just leaned in and been like, can you see me? I didn't want to. I keep forgetting the controls. I'm still used to Fatal Bullet controls. He's been playing Fatal Bullet. It's a it's a good game, but I, I agree that Kirito kind of sucks. Jammed? Where's the peanut butter? I'm not funny at all. I just wanted to say something about it. <laughs> Jammed? Why don't you just unlock it? Come on. Why don't you just unlock it? Can Come you... on, video game developers. Get you... with it. What are you, dumb? Come on. That man has more double chins than... <laughs> than a chin. I don't fucking know. That man has more double chins than I do! <laughs> okay, so I came from downstairs. thing jamming is me. Let's go. Yeah. We're gonna get through this and the audio isn't gonna be ooh, working. Hello. 
Oh, that's my wife. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was some rando. <laughs> I was like, do I jump? Do I not jump? Where am I? Oncoming wife. Oh God, Blake. Are you okay? No. What the fuck? No. no. We have to run. run. Well, that was easy. Now you Blake, can get out of here. Move. Fucking dumbass. What god has joined? <clears throat> Alright, let's get going then. Now, why are you fucking sitting around discussing about it? If you're gonna run, run, dude. Don't just be like, I think that the political structure of Idaho is definitely a little messed up. Like, come on, dude. She's going into labor. Someone call a doctor. <laughs> That's probably what's going on here. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, but they're kind of in the middle of Stop. fucking nowhere. I just, I mean, oh, Jesus Christ, Lynn. What's happening here? We're all dead. This is all just a hallucinogenic dream. Pilot's dead, though. <laughs> yeah, he's not coming back from that. Yes, you can. You're just refusing. Oh shit. We have to go. When? When? Stop being a crybaby. We have to go. I didn't want that on, but thanks. Why did you remind me? He sounds like Uncle Ruckus from the Boondocks. I don't think I've seen that. It's a very good show. It's a uh, show about the. Uh, it's like a, a, a band about the uh, like black and white stereotypes of like suburbia. It's about a, a, a grandpa and his two and his uh, grandchildren who live in a suburban household with a bunch of uh, white neighbors, and it's hilarious. But uh, Uncle Ruckus is a uh, black guy who says he he uh, pulled a reverse Michael Jackson. He went from white to black instead, and he's super like fucking. I can't say racist because he's actually black. Stay back! This is a this is a good clean Christian game. Motherfucker. All right, well that's the end of uh, this our last playthrough. That's the end of the game. We're all dead. Thanks for <laughs> thanks for joining us. <laughs> well, that was quick. I didn't want your cult in my game. So nothing's gonna happen. Bro, why don't you like turn on your, your night lights, bro? Just turn on your night vision camera, dude. Do you have an extra battery? I can't. I know. It won't let me take out my camera. <laughs> Not like I Oh, Jesus Christ. Isn't there something... Is, doesn't why, the does this, why, does this, this? why doesn't this guy... Why does this guy look like he just stepped out of a fucking hot topic? We have it's a girl. It's a girl? I think I'll see you again. She's wearing a fucking dress. I don't know, this place seems crazy enough for the guys who wear fucking dresses. This is a Christian establishment. We do not accept those transgenders. <laughs> oh yeah, they are disgusting. Still, come on. Well, that's rude. <laughs> I made a joke about it first, but I'm allowed to. I made a joke about it second because I don't give a shit. That was... One oh. of the more awkward 
I, I think I have control Jesus again. Fuck are they? Okay, are you missing your entire leg? Are you just sliding around right now? Just fix this. Well, water would probably do it. Well, that's some accurate water movement. Hey, Weeb. What? If the United States takes over an area um, that has a bunch of uh, horny mermaids, is that a current state of affair? You know, I thought that setup was going to be disappointing, but I didn't think it was going to be that disappointing. <laughs> oh, shit. You can't see me. I, I too can make bad jokes. Did you hear the one about the door? It was framed. I don't even know if I'm moving. You're moving. It's really hard to tell underwater. And he is not moving that flashlight. He probably sees me. I thought that was the moon. Oh, yeah, that's the moon. Now I, that's... I thought it was a guy with a flashlight. Don't judge me. I'm going to judge you regardless. <laughs> okay. Is this is probably dangerous. Was he in with her only mermaids? Because he sure looks wet. Flashlight is over there somewhere. So this man can use his fists. Why isn't he just like, yeah, punch? Oh shit. You can't see me if I'm underwater. That's the rules, right? I, th I think so. <laughs> ha. I am immune to oh shit. <laughs> I don't know where he was facing. <laughs> that wasn't okay for anyone involved. Why can't why can't any of these horror games just like you get to your goal, you find your wife or whatever, and you're just like, all right, let's go. It is getting really blurry. Like if these guys are so worried about the Antichrist, I'm just let us just like get her as far away as possible. Oh. Bro, run, run, that's run, pretty run, cringe. Run, 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 please, run, run. I don't know where I'm going. I thought that mu those music notes were up there for fucking physics. <laughs> Come on, dude. Oh. I have to stare at this, I guess. Oh yeah, you're supposed to be recording important events. Oh, for fuck's sake! It's one of those dumb stories about some angry, vengeful spirit. Or some bullshit. Isn't Jessica who we mentioned at the beginning? Yeah. Does, Lynn was like, you were saying a name in, in your sleep. I mean, Jessica. He's like, oh, just having uh, dreams about her. She killed herself, didn't she? Probably. I think I think that's what they said. Why, did, why does it always got to be vengeful fucking spirits? Repent. No thanks. Well, at least it's a... Uh, at least it's... Uh, pretty forward with what it wants. Well, I'm closing that. I can't hide in there. <clears throat> I really want to, but I can't. Can't hide in there, can't hide in there. What does it want 
from me. Bro, why the fuck is the gamma up oh. so much? It's just this place, I think. That's what that, that's what Blake looks like? <laughs> I'm scared to find out which one is him. It's the one in the middle! Dude, look at that face he's making! Which one? These two look exactly the same. I'm not crazy, am I? That one's taller. Yeah, but... Like you know, face. you know, you know how I can tell which one's which because one of them's dead. It would have had to be this one. This one's too tall to hang herself. You underestimate the power, of, uh, the willpower of someone who wants to commit suicide. <laughs> <laughs> like if she's gonna, if she's gonna complain, why'd she write it on a fucking chalkboard? Maybe she didn't write it on a chalkboard. This is probably just him going through a dream state. And he's in fourth grade music class, but that's a note he got, and he just sees it on the chalkboard because it's, rel it's related to his dream or something. I don't know. So if it's an angry, vengeful <laughs> spirit, I'm going to complain. Like, I'm going to whine about that. Yes, because walking down the creepy hallway, nothing's going to happen to you. You're fine. Someone's playing basketball. Which way's the gym? I know I can't play, but I like watching them. Probably should go the other way. I don't want to. Responsibility. I take none of it. Respect. Respect. I... <laughs> Hi, teacher. <laughs> Hi. I don't think that's a I teacher. I want a good look at you. Hi. <laughs> Hi, teacher. Man's is in the T pose, like not really, but the <clears throat> civilian pose, like. No, no, shit. No, no, no. How do I zoom out? <laughs> I am shaking and crying right now. I don't know how I managed to get through the hell without screaming. Oh, the teacher's gone. <sighs> am I supposed to go up here? I think you're supposed to go towards the exit, which isn't going to be really an exit, it's going to be... Woo! It's going to be another spooky moment. I mean, if I'm supposed to go to the exit, I want to explore over here. I think they purposely made it so you can't explore. Oh, there's a bar here. I didn't, yeah. I didn't see that. I was looking at it like this, I thought it was a... Well, I didn't see the bar there either, but I just thought about it logically. <laughs> if you're going to want a horror game, you can't just break the tension that easy, right? Teacher, where'd you go? Teacher? Oh, there's the office. Call mom. Wait, hey. what? Oh, I thought you read it somewhere. No. I'm not thinking about things right now. <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> I'm trying to play a horror game. Are you ready for spooky moment? It is gonna happen. I'm prepped for the spoops. <laughs> I am a brave child. Why did you zoom in? Because the spoops need to be seen. Okay, I can't see like that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, At least they let you have your camera in fourth grade. That's pretty cool. I can legit see nothing. I'd be better off just walking in the dark. Do you feel a breeze? No. Me neither. Well, I kind of do, because you have the fucking fan turned on me. Oh, I should probably actually have turned that off. I'll do it. Uh, yeah, go ahead. <clears throat> the so fan I can be makes immersed. Noise. The fan makes noise, and I don't want it to mess up the recording. Oh, no! That poor guy he just I thought you fell. said they were going to be spooks. What a... Poor guy, now he's gonna die! No, he's not. It's all a dream. Spoops is like some crazy guy chasing you. This was not Spoops. This was just falling. The outsider. No. 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 I'm fine. Uh, also, I live here. Um, very native. Come on. Who are you? Everything blurry. I see too much to keep you faith. But you're not one of two of them. The the heretics. Say, screw them up. I've got skull. Had to get cast out. Didn't go 
five of him. Probably gonna be the big twist. Sociopathic psychopaths that are out there. Who believe in God? Yeah. So well, God's you can believe in God, but not. Yeah, but they think they're doing it for God, so. And God's probably out there, like, what the fuck is wrong with these assholes? I don't know. I'm not blaming God. I don't believe in Him, but I'm not blaming Him. Guy's just chilling out, and he's like, what did I do? It's like the Sonic family. The guy created, created him, was like, fuck, I created a monster. I didn't, I didn't mean to. Sleep in the nondescript stranger's house who you just met. That's not going to go well. Or, you know, just go out at a time where you're more visible and easy to spot. That, too, is a high quality idea. Blake is a genuinely intelligent person in a horror game. I'm sleeping. I'm, I'm not, I'm sleeping. Cool. I'm sleeping. Will you shut up, woman? I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> Great. You've woke me up. Oh, no. Hi, new friend. Hi, new friend. Well, I lasted long. You two playing up there? You two having fun? You Are you talking about me? does, you know, that's the whole reason he exists, to, uh, talk to dead people. Thanks, Outlast. You can't give us any allies in this. I wanna play. I fucking hate games where they're like, they don't give you any allies because all of them die. That's so fucking dumb. I think you're committing a little bit of 
of structural damage. Um, maybe play a little hey, more softly. Hey, lady! Remember God's uh, Ten Commandments? One of them is, thou shalt not fucking murder people? Yeah, uh, you kind of just broke that. <clears throat> Game over. Where's the other guy? So she just uh. she just uh, <laughs> went against God's teaching. Like Jesus' teaching is to like forgive and forget. Mm -hmm. Like, come on, dude. I probably should have been recording her murdering people, but whatever. I don't even know if she's still here. <clears throat> Ethan didn't deserve that. E Probably did, honestly. He didn't. Yeah, he didn't. He, that's a good point. He didn't give her, give, give him up to him, or to her. He was trying to keep the guy safe because he fucking hates these people. He didn't deserve it, and you can't change my mind. People are kind of assholes. I thought this was a person for a second. <laughs> with their flashlight? Like standing up high with a flashlight, yeah. <laughs> Swinging it around. <laughs> well, like from over <laughs> there, from over there, it looked like a steady, like, search. Or, like, maybe they were walking. I mean, as far as they know, you're not around. As far as they know. keep thinking those are people. I mean, we've already established these guys aren't exactly Albert Einstein. Alright. Everything's good. Why can't I take the flashlight? The flashlight is like the one thing that I can use here. <clears throat> because you're a lover, not a fighter. It doesn't... It's not about fighting. Yeah, but you could use that mag light to hit things, too. But I can also use the light to light my way. Well, obvious. I'll be fucking this way, dude. Come on. Oh, my God. But I'm saying, like, that'd be too convenient. <laughs> then don't have a flashlight here. I just, I think it's... Okay, for gameplay reasons, yes. I get that you can't use the flashlight, but the flashlight is there, and this guy is too stupid to pick it up. It's like the one thing he needs right now. Maybe he thinks it looks like a toilet plunger, I don't know. <laughs> you know, I, I, mean, I need to plunge some toilets. I'm genuinely expecting, like, you to walk up to the edge of, like, a, a dock, and then some random guy comes out of the water, grabs you by the leg, and drags you in. I would not be surprised. I have no idea which way I'm supposed to go. Probably that way. Uh, do a quick scan with your night vision on. I can't see past the fog. Shit, of course. I can see better without it, honestly. Of course they wouldn't make it that mm. easy. Okay. Well, here goes nothing. When are they going to have spooky dead guy thing pop out of nowhere and have main character freak out because it's dead guy. Is that the house I was just in? No, it isn't. Yeah, no, there's movement, so. Hi, friend. Something tells me that they're not your friend. Hi. This would be a lot easier without the strings. Hi, friend. I still can't see. Can you hide? I can. I just... I can't see well underwater either. So I want, so, I yeah, want to try position, and see position position yourself out. in a way where you can, like, see straight forward. Or, like, towards your direction or whatever. And then go hide underwater and just go forward. I just... I want to... I want to know, like, definitively where I can go out. Because that looks like a fence, but there might be an opening. And that looks like somewhere I can just walk. 
Bro, I, I just say fuck it. If I get the thought, just get out of here. I think they left while we were talking. Hey, bro. I know these aren't people now, but it's still so weird seeing that. Okay. I can go across. I would hold my loved ones close, but you kind of fucking took her. Oh wait, I'm a heretic because I'm suffering or some bullshit. Christ. What am I looking at? The thing to the right. The guys are fucking kind oh. of dead. You know, I really thought it was just this thing on fire. Heretic. Of course it does. What, what, what was I expecting? Did they like shove horns in their face? Probably. Or are these just regular ass goats? <laughs> strung up. Yeah. No, those are people. Yeah, those are people. With goat skulls. Nice. Okay, they weren't a heretic until you legitimately put a goat skull on their head. Like, what have they done or said? <laughs> Okay. I was talking, and that thing came out. <laughs> I don't know what that sound was. Oh man, I'm terrified. <clears throat> Can't you tell I'm shaking in my boots? I'm supposed to go through the corner, aren't I? Probably. Ah, eh, walking straight through is probably fine too. Hey, he sounds like he's going for a swim. So what you're telling me is that nobody knows what the hell's going on here besides Blake. Like, nobody understands that what's happening. <laughs> I'm just I'm telling you dude you turn around you get the fuck out of there call some people be like yo there's these psychopaths in this place that I'm at uh, the close to fucking killing people why don't you like stop them sorry I'm trying to figure out where the guy with the flashlight went off to he was staring right at me and then Just saying, like, get the where? fucking where? Get the Pope himself to like just disown these guys. You can't see me. I don't exist. I don't exist, friend. Uh, being in grass always freaks me out because I don't know when I can leave. Oh shit. You know you know what would be a real good twist? What? What if this guy was a friend? No, what if, like, this entire time Blake's just been going fucking crazy? Like, he's running around in this place thinking everyone's gonna kill him? It's probably the case. I just... Like, <clears throat> some like some guy walks up and he's like, Hey, you need help? He's like, ah, 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 and he runs off and he's mm -hmm. like, The fuck? I'm trying to help him. He's just at a church. And it's... Like, they're just talking about, like, hey, the Antichrist might exist, and then he's like, my life is gonna get killed. <laughs> like, they actually took her in to help her. <clears throat> and then, uh, and then, like, she's also going crazy, so she, she thinks, he thinks that they're trying to harm her, too. They took her in because she legitimately believes that she's giving birth to the Antichrist. And, like, no, they took her in because she's wounded, and that's what, like, a Christian would do. If you need help, that's what, that's what a lot of people will do. But it's like, they, they think that they're trying to kill them because they think they have the Antichrist. I don't know if I'm going the right way and I can't see where the flashlight starts. And that's why they're looking for them, because they're like, I want to find them. I don't oh, want to help them. And then they're like, oh God, we're going to die. I don't even know if I went the right way. I might have just gone in a circle. 
Isolation is actually scary because they give you a specific goal you need to attain, you know, pushing a lever or something somewhere farther away. I legitimately just went in a circle. Nice. And then it's like they give you the alien who's so sporadic and random. There's no, like, set path and you have to, like, get around that, but you can fight back against it and scare it off. <laughs> I don't like games where, you, where, you, where they make you, like, helpless because... Even, I, I get it, like, giving someone a shotgun can give them a feeling of psychosis and invincibility, but isn't that supposed to, like, that would just lure them out and just, like, scare them even more because they realize they can't actually fight back. I think being helpless is scarier. I don't know. I feel like giving the illusion that you can, uh, uh, that you can like fight back, but it not doing anything is scarier. Because it's like you've tried, you've at least tried, and you realize nothing works. That you're fighting against an enemy that's actually much stronger than you expected. That's fair. I'm surprised I haven't died once yet. This is so shocking. Nobody's nobody's found me yet. I haven't died. I have no idea what I'm doing. Does Blake, does Blake have plot armor? He probably does. Probably. He survived a lot that would probably kill somebody. Like a helicopter crash. Please tell me I didn't just go in another Oh, circle. there's a thing. Where? Left. Mmm, mmm, loving those strings. So they care about this guy because he's the Antichrist. Or did something about his seed being responsible for the Antichrist. That's pretty not dope, bro. Like, they could at least give you, like, a rock to throw to distract them or something. I think I just have to go around them. But there's too many flashlights here. Like... 
Camera Simulator 20, like 17 or whatever it came out isn't like the most thrilling, I'm not gonna lie. Like, at least give us something to do, like throw a rock or, I don't know, fucking whistle or something. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I mean, I'm, worst comes to worst, just fucking book it. I am essentially trapped right now. I think I'm gonna have to book it, but I still don't know where I'm going. Well, why don't you go back in the way you were just and see... Because if you don't, if you run that way and it turns out it's a dead end... I'll have my first death. Or you can slip back into the corn. Ready? I just, I can't see if the person's here. Later. This is definitely me when I'm trying not to die from a crazy Christian cult. Mm -hmm. This guy's on my side of the fence. I, I physically can't leave unless he moves. Mm. Or maybe I can. He didn't see you enter. I want to see past my arm. I want to see if there's an opening there. It looks like there is. Okay. I just don't know if this guy's crazy. He's definitely crazy. He's sporadic. Look at him. Yeah, but like, crazy crazy. Because if he's crazy crazy, then I can't go anywhere. Because he's staring right at me. Okay, so like, you might have to just fucking book it again. Book it over there then? Yeah. Wait, is Matt following you? It doesn't look like it. Okay. He's just normal crazy then. That's good. Oh, come on. I mean, he's probably gonna jump scare you or something. Probably. Oh. Well, it looks like that guy pulled a Jessica. That's dead. Wait, is that somebody on there? Yeah, that's somebody. They're looking right at me. Motherfucker's just rocking back and forth. He has to see me, right? Probably. Definitely the opposite of kosher. <sighs> I know. What about that window that was behind you? Uh, back at the house. Or is that just a light? No, it's just a fucking light. God damn it. Interact. I just saw something. Yeah, I did too. I'm trying to figure out. Oh. Oh, it's this. Why couldn't it just be open? Jump scare. Blake, bro, forget
get the lady. Just like get out of there. Fucking book it. I don't care. It's like shit. No, no, no. Uh oh. Where am I? Where am I? Crap. Yeah, I'm trapped. I'm dead. Okay. That's one death for the record books. I didn't see him. We've been playing for what? A total of like an hour and a half of this game and you finally died. Uh, what time is it? It's 1240. Okay. We started at oh, 12 though. Bitch. Nope. Get out of there, get out of there! Put your fucking camera down! Crap. You may have just trapped yourself. Yeah, you totally did. see where this guy fucking guy is. And you don't waste battery. And then just use that. There's a place you can hide too. Where? Right there. Over here? The barrel. I'm just gonna go into myself here. Oh boy. Eek. Wait, hold on. Yeah, I thought I said his light flash. Probably he's pointing it back in here to come back in and loop. I could probably go through that door, but I don't. So next time he loops around, start fucking moving that stupid ass thing. Uh, which one? Uh, you probably can't see it through your hand, but it was over. It was over that away. Yeah, your hand's blocking it. Is it the shelf? No, you see. You see the ladder right there. Yeah. It's it's uh, it's in front of that. You'll, you you'll see it when you uh, when you get out. Am I supposed to go? There it is. The ladder? Hold on. Turn. Yeah, it's right there. Oh, that box. Yeah, that box. I don't think he's coming this way, but... It's better. Risk it for the biscuit? Yeah, I know how to do this if I die again, so... Just cry, yeah. Just move it. I mean, if they catch, if they spot you, you can also get up there pretty quickly. Yep, there he is. They're probably gonna think something's up. I think they're like, gonna be like, why'd this move, yo? Oh, that's definitely gonna break. I mean, at this point, it better break, because I don't know where to go. Maybe. Man, I'm just so cynical about horror games now. <laughs> like every every place I, I think they're gonna put a jump scare, I I'm like they're they're probably gonna put a jump scare there. And then they don't, and I'm like, bro, that's pretty cringe. Well, now I'm trapped up here. What am I supposed to do? Huh. Not supposed to. 
right there. Spooky. Oh, come on, this was a perfect place for a jump scare and you didn't do it. Breaking the mold, huh? That's a thing you can grab. Walk across as nondescript beam. Oh, come on, let me crouch. Totally just crouch on that. Wow! It saved. Who would have thought, right? Mm -hmm. Um, it's been about 40 minutes and it saved. It's been over 40 minutes. So probably almost an hour. Uh, so I think we're going to end this episode here. Um, I hope anyone who watches this enjoyed it. <laughs> you, should re you should rename these things like Blake's Bizarre Adventure or something. I'm just going to keep on going with the theme I've got going. Fine. I was, I'm just saying, I would have called it Blake's Club Wild Ride or something like that. I'll think, just, I'll think about that for something else, but... Maybe, right. maybe for the Alien Isolation series that'll happen one day. Ripley, Ripley's Wild Ride. Ripley's Wild Ride. Uh, so, I guess we'll do this again sometime. Uh, bye, folks. Later, nerds.